sounds like there's gonna be a ton of stuff. But you know what I'm digging about it? But any of the money that we spend here right. is going to go towards housing the collection for the town to have. Sure. I see oh the sign gosh, museum. How big this place is. This is huge. <laughs> Seriously, man. It's, it's like, like the of a football field. It looks like a chicken, chicken hatchery. Wow. The Americana Museum. <sighs> Must be inside. This place is enormous, man. It's huge. Hello. Hey, you Patty? I'm Patty. 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 How you doing? Morris, oh, I'm Patty. Hey, you're Patty. <laughs> <laughs> you got two Patties. What's your name? What's your name? Morris Hi. White. Morris. Hey, wow. Morris. Nice, nice to meet you. All right. First thing I notice is this place is huge. It's huge. This huge. is crazy. I don't think my grandfather's initial intention was to create a museum. He went to auctions often and he collected things. What he didn't sell ended up being left behind, and it ended up massing into a huge collection. Oh my <laughs> God! What this used to be? Chicken house. Triple decker. Chicken oh, house. you're right. We pulled up and Frank goes, that looks like a chicken house. I was chicken like, really? Or used something. to be. Mr. Burgess had chickens. So he had chickens all everywhere. He probably had 60,000. When they closed the chicken houses, he realized he had the space. So it evolved into a museum. Why did he open up the museum? I mean, what was the motivation on? His desire was for everyone who was living in a different time to see how things were in the days gone by, and I actually came through as a third grader myself with my own class. You did? I Must did. Must be exciting. I've been here since I was knee high. Can we take the tour? Sure. Have you got two dollars and a half? Frank will pay you. I'll pay you, I'll pay you the five. <laughs> He's got chip in. Come on, let's go. It's like a day-to-day -day treasure hunt. I'm out there looking for rusty gold. I'm looking for the unusual and impossible. It's back roads, it's dumpster diving, it's flea markets, it's people's homes.